1969, a musical western featured Lee Marvin, Clint Eastwood, and Gene Seberg. The film, based on a Broadway musical by Lerner and Loa, had a screenplay by Alan J. Lerner and Patty Chayefsky. Directed by Joshua Logan, it marked the last collaboration of this talented team. The show's obscure nature added to its mystique, captivating audiences with its unique blend of music, drama, and star power. With Eastwood at the helm, the film took viewers on a journey through a world where emotions ran deep and consequences were severe. As the story unfolded, the dynamics between the characters grew more intense, setting the stage for a dramatic turn of events that would leave one of its stars forever changed. This classic marked a pivotal moment in cinematic history, showcasing the raw talent and emotional depth of its cast. Through love, loss, and betrayal, the characters navigated a tumultuous landscape of passion and regret, culminating in a haunting conclusion that would resonate long after the final credits roll. The legacy of this film lives on, a testament to the power of storytelling and the impact of unforgettable performances on the big screen. During the California Gold Rush, a wagon crashes into a ravine and prospector Ben Romson rescues the surviving occupant. Clint Eastwood, the two form a partnership and discover gold, leading to the creation of No Name City. The movie showcases their journey through the challenges and triumphs of the Gold Rush era as they navigate the newfound wealth and complexities that come with it. With a mix of drama, humor, and classic Western elements, the film captures the essence of a time marked by both rugged individualism and the spirit of cooperation in the pursuit of fortune. Paint Your Wagon brings to life the untamed beauty of the Wild West and the enduring human quest for adventure and prosperity. Through their adventures, Ben and Clint forge a unique bond that defines their shared destiny in the uncharted territory of the gold rush. In the movie Paint, Your Wagon, No Name City is initially all male and excited when a Mormon with two wives rides into town. They convince him to sell one of them, Elizabeth, to Ben, who wins her in a drunken stupor. The town grows as men crave female companionship. The arrival of Elizabeth ignites a chain of events that lead to transformation and the introduction of new dynamics within the community. As tensions rise and relationships shift, no name city is forever altered by the introduction of the first woman. The portrayal of this evolving frontier town offers a glimpse into the complexities of human nature and desire in a rugged and unyielding landscape. In the movie Paint Your Wagon, to satisfy the men, Ben, and others kidnap six prostitutes from a neighboring town. While Ben is away, Elizabeth and the survivor fall in love. The abduction is successful, and a brothel is established, leading to the town's growth. A preacher arrives in the town and condemns the town's activities, predicting its downfall. Ben and his cohorts dig tunnels beneath the town to collect gold dust, leading to the town's collapse during a bull and bear fight. Ben departs, and Elizabeth, and the survivor reconcile. Lee Marvin's performance in Paint Your Wagon was criticized, but he is seen as adding a spark to the film. Marvin drank real alcohol during filming against the director's wishes, and his recording of Wandering Star became a UK hit. This classic showcases Marvin's unique approach to his role, bringing an authenticity that resonated with audiences. His dedication to the character shines through, even amidst the controversies surrounding his onset choices. Lee Marvin's portrayal leaves a lasting impression on viewers, solidifying his place in the legacy of this iconic movie. Gene Seberg's voice was dubbed in the movie. She described Marvin's singing voice unfavorably. Despite the film's poor box office performance and negative reviews, Sibberg was deeply affected by her affair with Clint Eastwood during filming. The struggles on set and personal entanglements added layers of complexity to Sibberg's experience during this classic. The production of Paint Your Wagon faced challenges as it went over budget and fell behind schedule. The film version took a departure from the original Broadway musical, leading to significant differences between the two. To modernize the story, the filmmakers discarded original plot elements and introduce new ones. This decision aimed to make the movie more relevant 
and appealing to audiences of that time. Despite the hurdles faced during production, Paint Your Wagon ultimately made its mark in cinematic history. Director Joshua Logan initially wanted different actors with musical experience for the movie. The location was a remote valley in Oregon, requiring extensive logistics to transport materials and animals. Local vagrants and hippies became extras after making demands. This classic was filmed in a picturesque setting that added to the authenticity of the story. The challenges of filming in such a remote location added to the sense of adventure and spontaneity of the production. The inclusion of local people in the film brought a unique energy and vibe to the scenes, enhancing the overall atmosphere of the movie. Extras in the movie formed a makeshift union and made demands for payment and food. You remind me down that can of beans was performed by the nitty gritty dirt bay. The role of Elizabeth was offered to several actresses before Leslie Ann Warren accepted, but had to bow out due to pregnancy. Kim Novick lobbied for the role but was rejected. Lee Marvin and director Joshua Logan struck up a deep friendship during the making of Paint Your Wagon. Marvin, known for his contrasting persona of being a southern gentleman and a heavy drinker, still managed to captivate audiences with his stellar performances in the film. Despite his alcohol consumption, Marvin's talent and dedication shone through, leaving a lasting impact on this classic. Their bond off-screen undoubtedly contributed to the chemistry and success of the movie, showcasing the power of friendship in the world of cinema. During the making of the film Paint Your Wagon, Clint Eastwood and Gene Seberg engaged in a passionate affair that resulted in Eastwood leaving his wife and Seberg leaving her husband. Sadly, the affair did not end well and played a role in Seberg's later personal struggles and eventual tragic suicide. This classic, depicting the gold rush era, was overshadowed by the real-life drama unfolding behind the scenes. Their tumultuous relationship had a lasting impact on both individuals marking a dark chapter in the history of this memorable production. Dean Seberg faced FBI surveillance and harassment for her civil rights support. After losing a child and facing public scrutiny, she went into hiding and ultimately took her own life in 1979. Paint Your Wagon tells the story of a small mining town where this classic is set, but centers around the struggles and triumphs of its residents. The movie portrays a glimpse into the human experience showcasing love, loss, friendship, and resilience. The characters navigate through their own personal hardships while coming together to build a community. Throughout the film, themes of hope, redemption, and the power of human connection are prevalent, resonating with audiences on a deep emotional level. Paint Your Wagon captures the essence of humanity's complexities, showcasing both the darkness and the light that exists within us all. In 1969, a musical movie called Paint Your Wagon hit the big screen. This classic movie takes place in the gold rush era, filled with adventure and music. The story revolves around a small mining town where two men strike it rich and end up sharing a wife, leading to all sorts of humorous and dramatic situations. Paint Your Wagon was significant for its vibrant soundtrack and entertaining storyline capturing the essence of that time period. This film remains a beloved piece of cinematic history that continues to charm audiences with its catchy tunes and colorful characters. When assembling the cast for the 1969 movie Paint Your Wagon, the casting process was meticulous. Clint Eastwood was chosen for his role after the director saw his work in previous films. Lee Marvin, known for his versatility, was selected for the other lead role due to his acting prowess. Key actors like Gene Saberg and Ray Walston went through auditions where their chemistry with the leads was crucial. Here's charm and Walston's comedic timing sealed their parts in the film. Pivotal moments during chemistry tests solidified the ensemble cast, ensuring they meshed well on screen. The casting choices defined the characters and set the stage for a memorable movie experience. The directorial vision behind the 1969 movie 
Paint Your Wagon was focused on creating a visually stunning and emotionally resonant film. The director aimed to bring the story to life by emphasizing the beauty of the natural landscapes where the movie was filmed and capturing the complexities of human emotions in the characters' relationships. Drawing inspiration from the Western genre and classic Hollywood musicals, the director infused the film with a mix of adventure, romance, and music. Their style incorporated wide scenic shots to showcase the grandeur of the setting, as well as intimate close-ups to convey the character's emotion. In collaborating with the cast and crew, the director encouraged creativity and improvisation allowing the actors to bring their own interpretations to their role. This collaborative approach helped to enhance the authenticity of the characters and their interactions on screen. The director also worked closely with the cinematographer to achieve the desired visual aesthetic, using lighting and framing techniques to evoke the mood of each scene. Overall, the directorial vision for Paint Your Wagon was one that sought to celebrate the beauty of the natural world the depth of human emotions, and the power of storytelling through film. During the production of the 1969 movie Paint Your Wagon, the set design featured elaborate recreations of a western mining town, complete with saloons and dusty streets. Filming took place on location in Baker City, Oregon, providing an authentic backdrop for the story. Logistical challenges arose from working in a real town requiring careful coordination with local residents and businesses. Innovative techniques were employed to capture the vast landscapes and musical performances. The use of wide-angle lenses helped showcase the expansive views, while advanced sound recording equipment captured the musical numbers with clarity. Additionally, the film utilized helicopter shots to capture sweeping aerial views of the rugged terrain adding an epic feel to the movie. Overall, the production of Paint Your Wagon was a blend of traditional set design with innovative filming techniques that brought the Western story to life on the big screen. The musical score and soundtrack of the 1969 movie, Paint Your Wagon, were essential in enhancing the narrative and emotional tone of the film. Composers Frederick Loa and Alan J. Lerner created a rich tapestry of music that captured the essence of the Old West setting. The songs in the movie ranged from lively and upbeat tunes to heartfelt ballads, each serving to deepen the audience's connection to the characters and their journeys. Musicians such as Lee Marvin and Clint Eastwood, who starred in the film, lent their voices to these songs adding a layer of authenticity to the musical performances. The music in Paint Your Wagon truly transported viewers to another time and place enriching the overall viewing experience. In the movie Paint Your Wagon, one iconic scene is the opening sequence where Ben Rumson discovers gold. The director Joshua Logan used sweeping shots of the rugged landscape to capture the essence of the gold rush era. Lee Marvin's performance as Ben showed a mix of excitement and greed drawing the audience into the story immediately. Cinematographer William A. Fraker captured the golden hues of the setting sun, adding a sense of magic to the moment. Marvin commented that filming this scene felt like stepping back in time. This scene's impact is in setting the tone for the adventure and drama that follows. Another standout moment is the musical number Wandering Star, where Lee Marvin's deep voice fills the screen. Logan's direction highlighted the loneliness and longing in Ben's character creating a poignant connection with the audience. The stark cinematography emphasized the vastness of the wilderness, adding to the character's sense of isolation. Lee Marvin described filming this scene as a personal challenge that paid off. This emotional performance resonates strongly with viewers, making it a memorable part of the film. Paint Your Wagon beautifully blends storytelling performance, cinematography, and direction to create unforgettable movie moments. Released in 1969, the movie Paint Your Wagon made an impact on both cultural and social fronts. Audiences resonated with its themes of communal living, friendship, and the pursuit of dreams in a changing society. The film's portrayal of diversity and acceptance reflected the societal shifts of the time, 
and sparked conversations about inclusivity and tolerance. Additionally, the movie's music, particularly the song I Talk to the Trees, became popular, influencing pop culture and leaving a lasting imprint on the era's music scene. Overall, Paint Your Wagon served as a mirror to the evolving values and attitudes of the late 1960s, engaging viewers in discussions on important social and cultural issues. The 1969 movie Paint Your Wagon received mixed critical reception. While some critics praised its music and performances, others criticized the film's plot and pacing. Audience reactions varied, with some enjoying the musical numbers and comedic moments while others found the storyline lacking. Despite the mixed reviews, the film did receive some recognition. It was nominated for two Academy Awards, including a nomination for Best Sound. These accolades recognized the hard work and talent of the individuals involved in the film, from the actors to the production team. They highlight the effort that went into creating the movie and showcase the skill and dedication of everyone who contributed to its success. During the filming of Paint Your Wagon in 1969, the cast and crew faced some unexpected challenges. One memorable incident involved the actors Lee Marvin and Clint Eastwood, who were not exactly known for their singing abilities, having to record the musical numbers for the film. Despite their lack of experience, they gave it their all and ended up surprising everyone with their performances. Another interesting tidbit is that the set was plagued by bad weather, causing delays in production. However, instead of getting frustrated, the cast and crew used the time to bond and create stronger relationships, making the filming experience more enjoyable for everyone involved. Additionally, the film featured a large number of extras for the musical numbers, which presented its own set of logistical challenges. Coordinating so many people for elaborate dance sequences required precise planning, and coordination, but in the end, it paid off with some visually stunning scenes. Overall, the making of Paint Your Wagon was a mix of hard work, camaraderie, and unexpected surprises, creating lasting memories for those who were part of the production. Paint Your Wagon, a 1969 movie, holds a unique place in film history due to its genre-blending elements. It combined a Western setting with musical aspects creating a one-of-a-kind cinematic experience. This innovative approach influenced future filmmakers to experiment with blending different genres, leading to the development of new and exciting film styles. Paint Your Wagon inspired a wave of creativity in the industry, encouraging filmmakers to think outside the box and push the boundaries of traditional storytelling. Its legacy lives on through the impact it had on shaping the art of filmmaking, and inspiring others to explore unconventional storytelling techniques. Have you ever watched the 1969 movie Paint Your Wagon? How did it impact you? Share your memories and experiences. Let's explore how this film influenced your perspective on cinema. Your stories are valuable and can inspire others. Engage with likes, shares, and subscriptions to discover more cinematic ones.